You know those scenarios where you see a wheel and you're in love with it where you're like, okay, I need to buy a car that can fit this wheel. And I feel like I'm in that scenario with these Edelweiss LT3s. Welcome back to another video. In the last one, we installed lowering springs or height adjustable springs on the car, and we talked about getting wheels, and we finally got wheels. It happened so fast, and it's finally here. I saw the Edelweiss brand for the first time when Dubsest, Lucas, who rocked them on his F80 M3. He got those wheels here into Ottawa. For me, I loved the design. I loved how concave they were. I loved how lightweight they were. And now finally, I have the G87 M2. Perfect opportunity to work with these guys. Eric over Edelweiss, such a great guy to work with. The team over there in general, super professional. I enjoy working with them. Just the packaging, the, the whole process of determining what sort of wheel and what size you need to actually having the wheel arrive. All four of them arrived on time and it was actually earlier than expected too. If you're looking for Edelweiss wheels, LT3s or LT5s, perfect fitment for your G87, he's the person to talk to. What do you all think? Do the champagne match the Zanvoort blue? I think the Zanvoort blue and the champagne is a perfect match. It's very different to what people are doing with silver and black and this pops without being overpowering. It's been a day since I got these wheels. Literally yesterday is when we installed them thanks to the help from Lucas. So let's take you back to that day and uh, share my experience. I also want to apologize for the bad audio quality. I messed up on the audio. I forgot to plug in the lav mic. Usual thing. Anyways, let's take you there and I'll see you back in a moment. UPS just arrived. I think we have some really cool packages here. Wonder what it is. Let's go check it out. Well, there it is. Four wheels through UPS. It arrived, paid the duties, and no hiccups. Came in record time. We did the whole package deal. This is one of the things I love about Edelweiss and the guys over there. I mainly work with Eric, such an amazing guy. But what I love about what they do is they, they know their stuff, they know their fitment, they know the tires, they know the wheels, and they put it all together into a package so you don't even have to worry about anything. All you gotta do is get the wheels, put them on, and they're good to go. So this will be the first G87 M2 with Edelweiss wheels. So let's rock them. This is the rear left, nicely labeled. How's it going, man? Hey. <laughs> Bit of a trek, huh? Well, thanks for helping out, man. Yeah, it's good. It's gonna be good. Can we tell it look? What do you What do you think? I like the finish. I think it's gonna look really, really good on Zander Zander Modern Zanderdorf Zand Zanderdorf Zand Zandvoort 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 Blue Zandvoort Blue. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Harry Potter, man. <laughs> it, see, it works with this color too. It does work. Yeah, of course it does. I've been trying to get you to put these kind of wheels on this car for two years now. It's happening soon. I want to see how this looks next to the car. Look at that. Whoa. That's going to look sharp. Oh, yeah. Damn. 
This is almost, I'd say it's more of like a white gold than, yeah. than even a champagne. I guess it is champagne-y. What... Yeah. But like champagne from Megan is like darker. Yeah. Brush so, champagne. This well, isn't brush. If though. you think about it, like Megan's champagne isn't, like there's no champagne that color. That's more like whiskey. Oh, uh, yeah. Right? <laughs> yeah. This isn't more like champagne. That's really. champagne, yeah. Like if you're actually comparing to an actual, like this is like Dom Perignon, right? <laughs> Is that what it is? I guess so. I okay. don't know my alcohol. All right, let's coat this dog carry on. <laughs> yeah, it looks good though. I like it. Oh, man. The arrows look nice. Oof, oof, oof. Coming sharp. He's marked every single one of them, rear right. Yeah, I like, uh, see, you can, t you, you know what? You, you get nice deep concave from these wheels. Yeah. Because look at the back pad. It's like flat. Oh, so wow. basically it's maxed out concavity on these wheels, right? That's pretty awesome. That's why they look so concave. Yeah, yeah. Look, look at the weights. Color match too. Oh wow. Ah. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> I'm very impressed. Yeah, yeah. You yeah, can't really like see. That. Like even, even these ones that needed a lot of weights. Yeah. Like look, just like a big strip of weights. Yeah. Looks really nice. Yeah, well it's I mean, last thing you want are, are black or like, you know, silver weights on, on patina, white gold, yeah, champagne yeah. looking wheels, right? So Champagne wheels, champagne weights. Yep. Oh, you have the nice tires too, the nice sidewalls. The PS4 S's? Oh, yeah. Are these the new ones or no? So, see, those have different sidewalls and then these. Oh, why is... So the rears are different There's three sidewalls. Because you went with a 305 25 21, so okay. they get this kind of like checker pattern. Ah. And then these are the PS4 S. I didn't even pay attention to that. So well, that's... Because so these are still velvet, like the, the, the velvet is still there on the Michelin. Yeah, yeah. But the but these ones get the checkered flag. Yeah, they even have a different texture, eh? Uh, it's a, honestly, when they're tire shine, they're the same. It's mm -hmm. just you get this. It's well, a, there you go. That's Details the, matter. That's the new, I guess, uh, sidewall for the like bigger wheel, bigger sizes. Cool. Yeah. What are we going to do to this thing? So. One simple We're going to get some Adam's polishes out. <laughs> we're gonna do wheel coating. Yes. Uh, then we're, we might even do uh, like two coats of wheel coating and then one coat of just like gold, gold uh, series, like uh, actual paint yeah. uh, ceramic. And then slap them on, take some pictures. Yes. I Hopefully guess. we have enough time. Yeah. Yeah. I think. Getting uh, these wheels on. That? Champagne. Yes. Good. Thanks to Erica Edelweiss. Yeah, it's awesome. Man. Finally, man. You know, you know, you know those wheels that uh, when you look at them, you're like, man, I need to buy a car to get those wheels. Yeah. That was these. <laughs> wow. Take a look at these. Twenty ones out back. 20s up front. Delivery. Not for me. Damn, those look good. What do you guys think? What do you think? I, I love the I love the color on the blue. I think it makes the blue look even better than like it did before. Yeah. With like the it, blue calipers and uh, everything too? Like blue calipers, like darker blue caliper, uh champagne wheel, like the Zandorf. Zandvoort. Zandvoort. <laughs> Zandolf. Smurf blue. Like, <laughs> People call it baby blue. Baby blue. Golf blue. Yeah. Yeah, so it, I, I, honestly it looks really, really good. I like yeah. it. The fronts I could maybe push out a little bit maybe with some spacers. Uh, you can... Honestly, the, the, it's pretty flush. Like the tire is sitting on the edge of the fender well. Yeah. So, and actually the back's pretty good too. I don't think you need spacers. You could yeah. be... If you're picky, I think if you were to bring the front lower, yeah. it would camber in a little bit. So you could afford to maybe put a, like a three or five yeah. mil in the front if you yeah. really wanted to in the future, but... Honestly, they fit like out yeah. of the box really, really well. Yeah, it's, I say so too. Yeah. Once we once we uh, like move it after we put the wheels on, it'll drop a little drop bit a little bit more. I think it'll it'll look sharp. Sweet. Oh, so good. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's do a quick walk around. I like it. I like it a lot. Wow. Fitment is on point. Yeah. It could go a little low, but that's good. We, we didn't move it yet, Prabhu. That's true. We just like, 
Watch, I'll release the handbrake. I bet you it'll go down. Oh. There's no handbrake in this car. <laughs> it's electronic. You gotta turn it on. Oh, it's a new car. Well, maybe drive it. Okay, first drive. Wow, look at that. It looks really, really nice. Wow, that looks good, rolling. Let's go catch him. All right, wheels are on. Thank you, Lucas. We're having a bit of pizza and admiring this view. Yeah, it looks good. Can't wait to do more content with this. First M2 on LT3s. Exactly, first M2, G87 M2 with LT3. And it looks dope. Let me show you the little care package Eric and those guys put together for me as well. It's quite amazing, the quality of product as well. Yeah, let me show you. So as part of the care package, got a whole bunch of stuff that he sent up in the box as well. Got the hat, which is quite amazing as well. Edelweiss lightweight. I love the gray on black with the green inserts here. We got a package here. Don't know what that is. Could Let's do a quick check. Whoa, that's cool. A little flashlight along with a pen. Really nicely done, guys. I, I, love, I love the attention and detail you guys have put into this as well. Super cool. Got the Edelweiss t-shirt, which is quite nice as well. That's, uh, yeah, white. Thank you, Eric. Good choice. Got a hoodie. We're going to be rocking all of this at impact as well. If it's warm, I'm going to maybe put that away. But if it's nice and chill, I think the hoodie is going to come very clutch. Yeah, that's really cool, man. That's really cool. Thank you. Thank you, Eric. Also in the box, we get the warranty, which is likely important. Uh, LT3s, BMW G8X, M3, M4. So that's what these wheels are designed for. Now, the G87 just seems to work. The offsets bang on. Again, it's all the G80 uh, suspension co components and things like that. So it just works. So if you guys want a G87 set of wheels that are super concave, these are the ones to go. Bunch of stickers, which we're going to use as well. Find a place for it. White is correct. The white is the right color for this Zanboard blue. So, super thanks. Oh, we got a mouse pad as well. Is that what this is? A mouse pad, I think? I don't know. I don't use a mouse anymore. Anything else in the box? I love this little detail as well. It's like, glad to have you on board, Prab. Enjoy, Eric. That's cool. Look forward to this journey, man. Well, there you have it. The wheels are installed. It's been ceramic coated just the one time by Lucas. Thank you, Lucas, for helping out. And uh, we're gonna drive this car, enjoy it. It looks great. I love how it's kind of fit in now. It feels the, the wheel well, it's a lot better now as well. I did 20 to 21 as well. 20 by 10 and a half up front and 21 by 11 out back. And I think it was ET14 and ET12. 
and the offsets could not be any better. It's the perfect match. The offsets are super flush and it works really, really well. One of the unfortunate things about the G87 or any M car in general with the stock steel brakes is the amount of brake dust it generates. Now, I'm gonna have to struggle with that with these wheels as well, but because they're champagne, you don't see the brake dust as much. It's gonna have to get really caked up in brake dust before you start to see the difference and, and where you need to wipe down or hose down. So I kind of like that, but either way, brake dust is such a pain. I'm not, not really digging that. Eric was kind enough to send a whole bunch of gear and we have a bit of a partnership. We're going to meet up at Impact, and you're going to see this car at the Edelweiss booth at Impact. So could definitely come check it out. I think you have to see this in person. Pictures and videos don't do the car justice, as I've always said. But when you see it in person, you really see how this car sits and its presence. It's just unreal for me. I'm just in, you know, la la land with this car. It's been a, a super amazing experience as well. So if you're going to Impact, definitely come by the Edelweiss booth and check us out. What do you all think? What do you think of the setup? Do you agree with the Zanboard Blue and the Champagne wheels? I think it looks amazing. What do you all think? Leave me a comment down below. And if you really enjoyed this video and if you're enjoying this journey with me, please like and subscribe to the channel as well. And uh, yeah, I'll see you all in the next video.